what's going on guys today we're doing a first taste of a new dark pepper flavor that came out fairly recently i think i want to say a couple weeks ago a couple weeks to a month ago yeah sounds about right first taste today of dark pepper strawberries and cream now not a fan of artificial strawberry although the dark pepper and cream soda i tried was very good and use dark pepper is usually one of the few soda companies that's very consistent with all their drinks like, I don't think there's been a single lot of that I didn't like, that I've tried. Like, even the Diet and Zero Sugar ones, you know, I don't find them too bad. So, not a fan of artificial strawberry, though, but I did try Pib Strawberry, the freestyle, and that was actually pretty good. So, and we'll see what happens here. And I'm filming this on Thursday, April 13th, which means I will be at Great Adventure tomorrow from the time I'm filming this. I'm probably not going to post till like much later though. Much later at night, I mean, but I will be at Great Adventure tomorrow, so please stay tuned for that vlog. And I plan to put a lot of first taste in the coming weeks. That summer, amount of summer freezing that comes out. Uh, the new Baja flavors, of course, and then, you know, maybe some others. This hits you with a strong strawberry. I think I heard some of this tastes like nest quick strawberry mixed dark pepper that sounds nasty i think uh, i hope it doesn't taste like that that's what i've heard i can get more of an aftertaste of strawberry than anything here bad i think it's definitely one of my least favorite flavors dog pepper i've had like i think regular cherry cream soda and you know even that dark berry one they put out i think they're all better than this but as someone that's not a fan of you know artificial strawberry really at all it ain't bad Okay, I can get somewhat of a creamy taste in there. It's not disgusting. I don't know if it's something I see myself buying constantly, but it's decent. I'm gonna go 3.5 out of 5. I don't love it, love it, but I don't absolutely hate it either. But I think this is definitely one of my least favorite flavors up here, but it's all relative because, I mean, you know, obviously. None of them are bad. To be honest, I think I liked him strawberry from the freestyle a little bit more than this, but even that I don't find like amazing or anything, just because I'm not it's not fan of strawberry flavored anything. That's just me. But yeah. Three point five out of five overall. Decent. Don't see myself buying this one with the regular dot pepper per se, but it's not bad. So, uh, you know, I'm, I'm going with that 10 rating scale actually now, so this is going to be a 7 out of 10. Definitely better this than some other sodas, but, you know, overall, would you know, I wouldn't really consider it the first choice. But yeah, first taste that will be coming in the, in the next couple of weeks. Um, Mountain Dew Summer Freeze, and that comes out, that's supposed to be like a bomb pop flavor. I love those. That sounds amazing. Hopefully, it tastes good. It sounds. Uh, a new Bowflare Cigar Caribbean Splash and Passion Fruit Punch. Those sound pretty good. And Energy Major Melon just came out. I thought that Bob Blast Energy Pitch Black Energy were disgusting, so I don't know if I'm going to try it. I might. And I might do a second taste of Energy Bob Blast. I was good to a first taste last year, but I was so focused on my trip that i never got to do it and yeah as nasty as it was like i might have to give that a second chance, a second chance coming back i don't know though not think about it so yeah that's a pretty much like i said seven out of ten for this not bad just one of my probably my least favorite flavor not pepper so peace out